Welcome to Ethical Board Education. Here there is a international news. The first country to ban sunscreen. So let's know the reason why it has ban. The Pacific Highland Palaw has become the first country to ban sunscreen that is harmful to corals. The country has banned common ingredients used in cosmetics including oxybenzone. The order of the ban was passed in 2018. However, it comes into effect from January 1, 2020. The Rock Highland Palaw is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The country has banned 10 ingredients that harm coral reefs. It includes oxybenzone, ethyl paraben, octinoxate, methyl paraben. But why Palaw has the only country which banned sunscreen? The here there is a reason. Palaw is made of large volcanic highland and small coral reefs. The country has taken several climatic steps despite of its size. Palaw was the second nation to rectify Paris climate agreement after Fiji. So how are sunscreens are harmful to corals? Yes, the sunscreen absorb UV radiations and make corals susceptible to bleaching. It is estimated that about around 6 to 14000 tons of sunscreen are washed. The next news India to set strict restrictions on non-essential imports from China. Ministry of Commerce and Industry has announced that 371 items from China will get strict restrictions from March 2020. The move aims at curbing imports of non-essential items such as plastic goods, toys, furniture, sports. The rules are to be framed by the ministry in coordination with BIS. Though the rules focus on Chinese imports, it will also be applicable to Indian producers in order to make regulations WTO compliant. The significance: the non-essential commodities imports include petrochemical, chemicals, heavy industrial products, steel products, telecommunication, electronics. Apart from trade relation with China, India is also concentrating on free trade agreement with Asia. Japan South Korea that enjoy free access to Indian markets the step is being considered to boost domestic goods the imports from china that are categorized as non essential amount to 4 trillion usd also trade deficit with china is widening and it currently stands at 553.6 billion usd the step will help in reducing india's dependence on china and will also helping curbing low quality imports from china